I love my little town of Newburgh, Oregon. My family has lived here for over 30 years. And while it might not be so little anymore, there is still a lot to love. So today I thought I'd share five fun things that people like to do in Newburgh. So come on. Hi, I'm Carrie Palmore, a licensed principal broker with Premier Property Group, LLC, and part of the Palmore Group in Newburgh, Oregon. And today, I thought I'd share five things that people like to do for fun in my little hometown of Newburgh, Oregon. These are in no particular order. First, many people have heard about the Allison Inn and Spa. Located on the outskirts of town, the Allison Inn is a beautiful addition to our community, and it's a luxury resort and spa. Situated on 35 acres with views of vineyards, farmland, and the beautiful Willamette Valley, it's such a great place to relax. We get many visitors to the area who are coming out to try our wineries, attend a conference, or just get away from it all. So here is the best way to spend the day. You arrive at the Allison Inn in the morning and you check into the spa. And once you get your robe and slippers, you mosey down the hall to the steam room, followed by the sauna. Next, you enjoy a spa treatment like a massage or a facial. And when you are done, they bring you back to the lounging area. Here you can lounge the rest of the day away, either inside or outside, ordering drinks or a meal if you'd like. And when you've had all you can take, I mean really, is that a thing? You get dressed and you go upstairs where they have this beautiful rock wall fireplace and you can sit and enjoy a drink from the bar while you visit with friends. Or if it's a sunny day, you might choose to sit out uh, under the covered patio and enjoy the views of the valley. It's gorgeous. At dinner time, you wander over to their signature restaurant, The Jory, for a delightful meal that you are sure to enjoy. Oh my gosh, I am drooling just thinking about it. And for a real treat, you could book a room and stay the night. Next, let's talk wine. We have so many wineries in the Willamette Valley and here are a couple of fun facts. There are 24,436 acres planted on 756 vineyard. And if you are looking for something to do, you can spend your time visiting our 592 wineries. That's a whole lot of vino. In our Newburgh downtown area, we have 10 wine tasting rooms, and about a mile and a half away is Dundee, and I counted 28 wineries. I'm thinking that a field trip video might be in order, but that's a topic for another day. Number three, calling all golfers. We are talking about Shehalem Glen Golf Course. Situated in a neighborhood called The Greens, Shehalem Glen is a professionally designed municipal 18-hole course, and let me tell you, it is not for the faint of heart. The hills, ravines, trees, and homes make this a very challenging course. Personally, I've lost many golf balls in the ravines, but it is a beautiful course surrounded by hills and valleys and running through the beautiful neighborhood of the greens. And if you're a golfer visiting the area, you definitely want to give this one a shot. No pun intended. Another fun family activity in Newburgh is our aquatic center. Newly rebuilt in 2018, the Aquatic and Fitness Center has a lot to offer. In addition to a competition and a lap pool, there's a family pool with a kid's area, complete with a fire truck for the kiddos to climb on and jump off, along with water buckets that dump on their head. They dump the water on their head. And then there's a lazy river, a hot tub, a slide, and a rock wall where you can climb up the wall and then fall back into the water. It's really cool and it's a lot of fun. And when you're done swimming, you can also take the kids outside to play on the play structure in the park for a while. This is sure to tire them all out, and you, so you can take a nap. Also attached to the pool is the new fitness center with indoor walking track, basketball and volleyball and pickleball courts and a workout facility. They offer a ton of classes throughout the week, so check it out. Finally, the last attraction I'll talk about is near and dear to my heart, Vista Hot Air Balloons. My husband is one of the ground crew members and getting up early in the morning on a summer day, meeting at the field and helping to get all the balloons filled up with air and then climbing in the basket to float over vineyards and farmland and rivers. And if you're lucky, your balloon might even take a dip in the river. It's so much fun and it is absolutely stunning up there. And after the flight, they top it off with an amazing catered breakfast with champagne and mimosas you definitely want this one on your must-do list. 
So that's it for today. A look at some really fun things to do in Newburgh, Oregon. There are so many other things to share about this town that I can't wait for another edition. Below, you can find the links for all of the places that I talked about today, so go check them out. I hope that you found this helpful. If so, hit the like button below and make sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any videos. We publish them on a regular basis and we wouldn't want you to miss anything. And if we can ever be of help, don't hesitate to reach out to the Palmore Group. We are here to help you with your real estate needs. You can check us out on our website or give us a call. Our mission is to provide exemplary service from the heart and we would love to help you. So until next time, remember, it's a good life.